I'm Scott Stein and this is the Logitech Solar Keyboard Folio for the iPad. Now I know what you're saying, Scott, why another keyboard case for the iPad? It's true, there have been a lot of these because there hasn't been a perfect solution and a lot of people take their iPads on the go to write. Well this one has a wrinkle, which I kind of just revealed to you, it's solar powered and that means that you don't have to carry an extra USB charger with you. In fact, this doesn't even come with one, but if you charge it on the back for what Logitech says could be as much as six hours or even faster, uh, you're gonna get up to two years of use if you type two hours a day. Now, I haven't had time to review this keyboard case for two years. I have, however, in the past few weeks, found it to be very good at charging fast, and so far it's been working great as advertised. The keyboard here is a very high quality keyboard. Logitech's really been going aces lately with their iPad cases and their keyboard solutions. The ultra thin keyboard cover was one of the best reviewed ones that we've had at CNET and Logitech's made a variety of them. This one is a thicker, larger keyboard, it really feels like a laptop keyboard, maybe a little more plasticky, definitely feels comfortable for extended sessions. And what's nice about this case is it has a second viewing angle. That's right, if you move it down to this notch, it'll go into a video viewing mode, and all these buttons down here will activate and turn into volume buttons and fast forward buttons. Now there's something kind of automagic about this, to use that word, that this connects via Bluetooth without having to turn it on or off. The moment that you take this case and fold it over into this mode, it begins the pairing process. And when you deactivate it, Voila, like magic, it turns off. That's really nice in terms of saving power, and if in case you fold it up and accidentally press a key, you won't be typing something crazy on your iPad. Now the drawback to this is that one, it's $130. That's expensive. But a lot of keyboard cases and covers for the iPad are pretty expensive. But two, even though it looks great, trust me, it doesn't feel as good as you'd expect. Now I'm not talking about the keyboard, I'm talking about the case. This is meant to be a folio case. So you open it up like a book, hopefully you can use it that way. But between the heavy keyboard on one end and this sort of almost off the roll feeling upholstered strip that connects the whole case, it feels a little flimsy. And that's not something that I would have expected on a $130 accessory. Now when you fold this up, it does fold nice and flat. And it feels very rigid and sturdy. And this big tubular battery that's here, uh, you know, I guess it needed to be necessary, but when you close it sometimes, Sometimes it crashes up against the iPad cover and it makes for a little bit of hard negotiation to make sure you've nested it just right. If you can get past those elements and the fact that, well, this cover here for the uh, solar part is a little flimsy and flexible feeling. I don't know how that'll last over time. We did get dust under the edge of ours. Uh, it's a very good keyboard and if you keep it folded up in that mode when you're traveling, you might really love the fact that you don't have to charge it. I'm Scott Stein, and that's a look at the Logitech Solar Keyboard Folio for the iPad, and that's iPad 2 and 3rd Gen iPad.